Hello, this is Pat Walker at MissionWinners.com. Doing a training coaching video here. I like to coach people. I think it's very, very important. It's not just about giving ideas. It's about understanding trading techniques and rationale wise. why. By so doing, it enables you to run with it. That's, that's our goal is to coach and educate so that you can do this. It's very important. A couple of days ago, Investors Daily talked about QQQ and SPY and that instead of doing individual stocks, you could just do the indexes. And before that article came out, I was telling the VIP members that right here, we have a higher low. This is a couple of days ago. I shifted this back so you could see what we were looking at. And now I'm thinking if it can fall in reverse or just take out the highs of this day, you have a higher low and that would be positive. I will advance it a day and you can see it gapped up. See the open? There's the open right there. It gapped up and it ran up and it took out the previous day's highs on a pickup in volume. That was an entry right here. So we start some. Do you go crazy? No, you don't. You're in a downtrend. But for the first time, you've got a simple higher low here that seemed like it could work after a pretty good washout. Okay? You could say, what's the difference? This really didn't have heavy volume. This really didn't have heavy volume. This has heavy volume. This is really dropped now. So we said, okay, we'll do some of this. So we picked some up, taking out these highs, closed good that day, advance it here. All right, this is today. Rallies up, but on less volume. So what did we do? We sold some into strength. It's a good move right here. And that's how you do it. I'll show you another one. Here's SSO. This is the other one. IBD talked about these. And we were looking at this, and I was telling the VIPs about this long before it was in the IBD. I thought it was kind of ironic, but that's okay. SSO was down. You can say, well, it was down on a pickup in volume, but the volume here was substantially less than this. I didn't know what it was going to do. We don't know the future, but could we have a plan? Well, at this point, you do have a higher low. Advance it one day. What did it do? It gapped up and it took out the highs of this bar. That changes the higher the setup and makes it a higher low setup for us. It didn't explain that well. So now you buy it, taking out the highs of this bar, which we did. And it moved up nicely. And then you get this today. Rallies up on decreasing volume. That's the one negative. So what did we do? We sold some into strength right up in here. We didn't sell it at the top, okay? That, that's, that's a liar's game. But again, folks, just I'll go back. You can say, oh boy, this, this, is, this is ugly. Holy Toledo, man, I'm glad I'm not in it. Yeah, boy. Oh, look at that. That's good, but I ain't good enough to buy the bottom. And neither am I. I don't know anybody who buys the bottom, you know? Liars, maybe. Does this, does this, does this, right in here. Falls on a pickup in volume. Oh, look at that. And goes. And what is it? It's just a higher low. This low was higher than this low on those two major indices. IBD talked about it. We told the VIPs about it before IBD mentioned it. And it's lifted up. So we'll see what it does. I just want to explain that to you. It's something we do. It You can, you can get overwhelmed with so much information. And I have to tell you, there's a tremendous amount of information in the chart. If you just look at that and say, well, gosh, I guess if it stays here, uh, this low is higher than this low. If it starts to go up, maybe if it takes out the highs of this bar, I should buy some. It's just a higher low. Ain't nothing fancy. And it worked. So I wanted to share that with you. I hope that helps you. That's my goal is just to educate, coach. Both these were on the key list. Both of them were mentioned and VIPs on them. So thank you very much.